Live Sports Desk, sponsored by your New England Ford dealers. Postseason basketball breathing new life into the Catamounts as they try to knock off the stink of a disappointing trip to Maine. This time, they're back on their home floor. Welcome into the NBC5 Sports Desk. I'm Noah Searson. University of Vermont women's basketball fully believed its season was over after UVM's America East Championship loss. But it had earned an at-large bid to the WNIT tournament with a bye into the second round. That's where we take things tonight. That means one last ride for fifth-year seniors Emma Utterback and Delaney Richardson taking on Niagara. First quarter, Kieran Hansen getting the steal, and she's going to take it all the way on the other end, score herself. So Vermont gets this thing within one, but it would be back and forth. Catamounts opening up a bit of a lead in that first half. Angela Montage with a barrage of three-pointers. She had four in the first half, then she able to find Bella Vito. Catamounts led by 10 in the first half, but Purple Knights won't go away easily. How about this? At the end of the half, Angel Parker with the scoop layup. So after 20, Purple Knights, or Purple Eagles rather, get this thing within six. Full court press starting to pay off. Parker able to tie it after a turnover is forced by Niagara. They lead by a pair then, but in the fourth quarter, Utterback comes up clutch, drilling the three-pointer to put Vermont back up. And from that point, Catamounts won't relinquish the lead in a 69-63 win thanks to a career-high 19-point effort from Botic. We did a really, really good job of like handing the ball pressure. Um, and that being said, I also had a lot of pressure on myself, like getting those shots, being confident. But you know, at the end of the day, everything starts from the practice. That's that's my comfort zone, and that's when I was in free throw line, I was like, okay, you got it. This is just practice. She loves high pressure situations, and I thought she did a good job um, taking big shots and making them. Uh, sometimes I want her to take more shots, um, but she just keeps getting better, and I think uh, she is really talented and she's really helped us in the second half of this season by playing confident and doing what Angela does. Vermont takes on Colgate in the third round after the Raiders dominated Providence on the road 54 to 41. Catamounts going to take on Colgate between Wednesday and Friday of this week.